Let's take a look at how the stealth station axiom technology can be used for placing a ventricular shunt. You'll notice as I'm getting ready to place the shunt that this patient is not in pins, and yet we're still able to accurately navigate and align our trajectory, which is especially beneficial in trying to hit those really difficult targets. And then I can begin to pass my catheter into the patient's brain. And as this catheter passes, if there is any deflection, you'll be able to pick it up on the screen. Once I'm happy with the placement of my catheter, I can remove the stylet, and you're done. Let's look at, for a moment, some of the trade-offs between a freehand shunt placement, an optical-based shunt placement, and an axiom-enabled shunt placement. In a freehand shunt placement, no navigational information is available to help align the catheter trajectory. Variations in patient anatomy and anatomical landmarks can make it difficult to ensure the surgeon is on the right path before passing the shunt catheter into the brain. In addition, deflection of the catheter stylet during insertion cannot be detected, so even the most experienced surgeon with a well-aligned trajectory can still miss the ventricle. With optical navigation, the added benefit of trajectory planning and the ability to align to this trajectory prior to placing the catheter is an advantage over freehand placement. However, because all optical systems track the spheres on the handle of the instrument, the system is unable to identify deflection in the tip of the instrument. Because catheters require a thin stylet, it is impossible to make the instrument perfectly rigid. As a result, an optical navigation system may show the tip of the instrument in the patient's ventricle, when in fact a tip deflection could result in the tip advancing toward a critical structure with no warning to the surgeon. Stealth station axiom navigation provides the ability to align with your optimal desired trajectory and the confidence in the knowledge of where the tip of the stylet truly is throughout the insertion of the catheter.